Okay, someone commented on my YouTube video on this boombox and the kind of power supply you'd need to run the uh, amplifier. I have the TPA 3116D2. It can output 50 watts per channel, left right channel, and 100 watts subwoofer. And you can use 24 volt and about 5 amps and I am only using a 16 volt laptop power supply capable of putting out only 3 amps but I think because of my design of the boombox is very efficient so 3 amps 16 volt should be plenty so I'm gonna play a couple of tracks from the YouTube audio library here yeah. set to just a little below uh, 12 o'clock and the treble, treble at the mid position, bass at the mid position and this is a sort of like a low pass filter and it cuts off all the high frequencies. So this is slightly towards uh, the left instead of the mid position. So I'm going to play YouTube audio library Para Santo Domingo by Jimmy Fontanes. I'm about three feet from the boombox seat. Okay. Voy a cantar esta canción con mucho cariño de mi corazón a la República Dominicana, la casa del merengue y la casa de la bachata. Voy a cantar esta canción con mucho cariño de mi corazón a la República Dominicana, la casa del merengue y la casa de la bachata. La La casa del merengue, la, 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 y la casa de la bachata. Okay, the second piece I'm gonna play is called Ever Felt Part 1, Otis McDonald. And um, I'm gonna turn the low pass filter just to demonstrate um, how it works. So here it is.
Okay, so um, that's a quick demo and you can make the sound brighter uh, or not. Um, this pair of speakers have a more flat response and it might sound a little dull actually. So because I'm, uh, I'm not a young person, so I tend to set this a little bit brighter or um, I guess what they call tune high uh, because the high frequencies um, I'm not that sensitive to it so I have to make it sound a little brighter so hopefully um, you find this useful um, this kind of design is the speaker design is very uh, uh, efficient so you don't need more than a few watts to, to drive the speakers and if you're afraid uh, you, you don't have a hundred watt output well don't worry about it you know even 10 watts can drive this pretty pretty loud okay thanks for watching the demo